Well, David, unfortunate defeat tonight, but you must be happy with how they played. Anthony, I'm so proud of the players. Um, let's put the cards on the table. The last couple of games, we were disappointed that we didn't get the results that we wanted. Um, but when you actually look back over the last five league games, we hadn't scored a goal. So the, the, the problem and the difficulty we had, quite evident. It's about putting the ball in the back of the net. But coming in, you know, to tonight's game against you know a Glen Torn team who I've been on record several times as saying I've got the most in-depth quality squad that there is in, in the country. Them coming off the back of a unbelievable victory and performance against Linfield, where I understand three 0 could have been much more. Um, we knew it was going to be a tough ask tonight, and yet I reminded the players that the last four times that Glen Torn have been here, you know, they haven't beaten us. And in fact, obviously the last time they were here, we won two 0 but we knew it was going to be really difficult. We knew it was going to be really, really tough. And to a man, the players stood up brilliantly. I thought the first half we played particularly well. I thought we passed the ball about. We had a great shape about us, great discipline. Everyone was working their absolute socks off. Because I simply said to the players beforehand, listen, let's just go out and give our best and see what, see what that takes us. Really disappointed to concede when we did. Um, and yet, so unfortunate, the goal, you know, the ball comes off I think Ross Redmond and, and could have gone anywhere and unfortunately it ended up and, and, and they're in the back of the net but the story of the second half was five minutes you know killed us again set pieces and big Jordan Williamson you know accidentally slipping you know which gave the Glen Torn player the advantage and there's a I'm not sure it was maybe Kim you know for, you know again went over you know, the, the, the frustrating goals um, but they weren't glaring errors, you know. It's not as if we were opened up tonight. We weren't at all. I thought we we continued to play even with three one down. There was no throwing in the towel. There was a real res, real resilience, a real des, the desire to, to continue to keep going. Could, could we get get one back and see where that would take us? Ultimately tonight we've got to say, you know, well done to Glen Torn. And we've got to acknowledge that, you know, they're a quality, quality team. You know, even you think of the players that they have available to them. Our squad is that little bit smaller. Uh, for you know, after we sort of restructured there in the new year, but you know we, we were without David McDade this evening and big Douglas Wilson, he was out through suspension. Um, obviously, shut Sean O'Neill then was out with it with a knee injury. Although Jordan came in, did very well, and I see Jordan and Sean as two number ones to tell you the truth. Um, but you know, without David and Douglas, you know, with, with the squad that we have, you do miss that that quality. But the players did. You know, did, did tremendously well, and I'm really proud of them. And, and I've got to say a personal thank you to those supporters tonight who actually applauded the players off. Who actually got, you know, the, the the fact that they didn't give up, that they tried to pass, they tried to play, they gave absolutely everything that they, they possibly could. You know, I don't do social media as people well know. So, but I'm told, you know, some of the, the criticism, that, you know, that's going about and that words are being said, and it's pretty easy to sit behind a keyboard and and and. and to be discouraging, you know, and, I'm, it, and it's not that we're we're afraid of of, of criticism or, or or don't merit criticism, not in any way, shape, or form. But you know, what was pleasing tonight um, was just the, the appreciation of hard work and effort and commitment. And um, as I say, that that was that was, as disappointed as we are we are with the res, the result. Obviously, you know, I can't thank the players enough for their how, how much they gave.